Breaking news, breaking news, folks. It has begun. That massive solar flare that erupted on the sun, uh, 9.3 X-class. The solar flare that erupted, the CMEs have arrived. They've arrived early. They came early, and they're in process right now. Matter of fact, Sunspot uh, 2673 remains very active uh, because of the incredible disturbance going on in the sun. Even though the sun is supposed to be in a solar minimum, we're seeing activity as if it was in a solar maximum. And uh, reports are in now that the uh, massive uh, solar flare eruption, the 14th largest solar flare in the history ever recorded off the sun, the CME has just hit the Earth's magnetic field. I repeat, the CME has just hit the Earth's magnetic field, according to spaceweather.com. This is the debris from Wednesday's decade, Class X 9.3 solar flare. Matter of fact, it arrived earlier than expected, and we are confirming there is a severe, I repeat, a severe G4 class geomagnetic storm In process, as our planet's magnetic field reverberates from the impact of this, expect an earthquake. Expect earthquakes. And we may see a big one. Matter of fact, uh, it's, it's very concerning to me. Now, the flare, and also the flares continue there. Okay, Sunspot AR2673 remains very active today, producing three M class solar flares. One was an M 2.4, one was an M 1.4, and then boom, during the broadcast earlier today, a massive uh, M class 7.3, and then another X class 1.3. Now, this is unbelievable, folks. Four major solar flares today we're not, and we haven't felt that pressure yet, but the big one from yesterday, 9.3, that the CME from that has just arrived. Now, BP Earthwatch, I'm sure, is scrambling right now, getting all of the data as accurate as possible. He is very concerned that a major earthquake could come from all of this pressure from the CMEs. And what does this mean? I'm saying to you that in the next 72 to 96 hours. In other words, in the next four days, we're on a high, high, high alert for a major earthquake. I know we're all going to be watching Hurricane Irma and what it's going to do. And matter of fact, the governor of Georgia just ordered 540,000 of his residents to evacuate immediately. This actually on Saturday morning, At 8 a.m., they're turning the interstates, they're turning all the traffic from Interstate 16 away from from the coast, and they're going to flow them in toward I-75. And I-75 is already jammed with people coming out of Florida because Governor uh, Rick Scott has uh, ordered a state of emergency for Florida. So now Governor Nathan Deal has declared a state of emergency for Georgia and has ordered over a half a million people to evacuate. So while that's all going on, folks, we have a major significant events taking place on the sun. Now, all of this, Hurricane Harvey, Kim Jong-un detonated a nuclear bomb causing a 6.3 earthquake, Hurricane Irma, on the way, toxic flooding in Houston, and now a geomagnetic storm on the earth caused by massive solar flares erupting from the sun. Something biblical is going on here with the signs of the second coming of Christ. Give your life to Jesus Christ. This is the coming apocalypse.